All right, man, let's keep these, these rolling because the more we find out about Sanji and his family, the more geeks I get to see more. Because in the, in the last one, we found out that his family is the well, the Vin Smoke family. That's his last name. And they're at the top of an organization called Germa 66, which is like a criminal organization, but that his family is a group of assassins. It's just insane. Everything has gone out the window. Everything I previously thought or knew. And we really didn't know that much about Sanji, but this is the last thing I expected. I'm gonna continue Zone today. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub so you don't miss anything. And let's get started. <laughs> classic, classic Luffy. <laughs> Luffy's like, I don't care if he's married. We need to cook, bro. Also that, yeah, that's, that's true. Well, maybe it's like a good coincidence that Luffy already picked a fight with Big Mom in the first place. Oh, okay. Wait, he called Peckham's Lion Viper? Is he mixing him up with... Yeah, he's already trash talked her. Uh-huh. He's like, this, this kid isn't scared of that? Peckham's is actually like dying. Aww. <laughs> Wait, that was so randomly sweet. I'm glad somebody is amused by Luffy here. Why? Peckham's knows more. No one can turn down an invitation. What, because she's an emperor? That's why? Or is there more to it? A shocking present. Is, is the present death? <laughs> okay, I figured, Peckhams! Oh, a cigarette reminds me of Sanji. That decap... Brother! What the? Is that just like Big Mom's like signature move? Ew. Oh, who's close to Sanji? Would it be one of the straw hats? Oh, okay. No! Zef! Patty! That's Karne, I think. No, that is Patty. I'd like to see freaking Big Mom try to take Ivan's head. I'd like to see him try. See her try. Because because uh, Peckham's is from there. Hmm. I don't know, this is kind of like bar for what I expected. Just like, if you disobey Big Mob, you, you're punished. I mean, it kind of helps. If Peckham's like genuinely helps us, it would help a lot to have him on our side. A lot of inside information. Let me use your worry, my saviors. Oh, even if they get married? Oh. To unify what? Then Smoke and the Charlotte family. What, so that Big Mom has like power over Germa 66? Yeah, but like still in a technicality, they'd be her subordinates, no? Ah, uh, it would remove him from the crew so they wouldn't be subordinates, I see. And this movie's like, well, that's just unacceptable. Come ahead, I don't care, I'll fight. I want to see Sanji's dad so bad. I just want to know if he's like as horny as Sanji, even remotely. Like, how normal is the Vince? I guess they're assassins. They can't be that normal. I'll go back to mom after I get walls. So he's he's planning on going back. Uh. Oh, shoot. By yourself? Why would you do that? Seems like we won a war. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure that's the only choice here. It's like Big Mom's not gonna be like, oh no, that's cool. Yeah, you can have you can take Sanji back. Sneak into the tea party. Yeah, technically we are enemies, but that's why I said maybe Peckham's will help. <laughs> he said it's a deal, and Peckham said no. Interesting. This is, I'm very shocked that he said he wants to go alone. I feel like that's a little uncharacteristic. Straw hats go everywhere together. Or at least they try to. They usually don't, actually. I don't think he is. <laughs> yeah, Zoro was like, guys, I, I'm more worried about Kaido. I'm not going to lie. And I don't blame him. From the short glimpse of what we saw, I would also be terrified. Oh, no. They're still after Brook. Dude, leave him alone, man. It's so inappropriate. Like, this has to be racism in some form or fashion, man. I can't stand for it. Or is it like reverse racism? Like, they like him too much because of his race. She's more of a species of skeleton. Dude. I think I forget how large he is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I love this cat, bro. Cat Viper, isn't that what he was calling Peckums? Am I tripping? Probably. Dude, he's he's so much more cheerful now. Like he's very cold at first. Oh my gosh! Damn, bro, he's crazy. I really do like him more than the dog, though. I have to say. Well, the dog is more like reserved. Bro is gonna get himself killed. Oh shoot! I don't think we've seen this one yet. Choppers is so cute. Another new one. Oh, wait, we've seen Laws. Where is Law with like Beppo and all of them right now? Oh, <laughs> speaking of the devil. In the, dude, where is Kinemon? Uh, yeah, yeah, in Conjuro. Bro, Momo's just chilling in some back room somewhere. Bro, Chopper's lover. Uh, he's pulled a baddie. <laughs> <laughs> oh nine i like how lol walks up he's like yeah it's about par for the course oh the crews are meeting officially i like how beppo's the only one with a different uniform let's go slighted what because he like put his hand up he's like take it what they want an actual like former introduction dude law's crew is so unlike law it's very bizarre you say that like you had a choice oh okay it's a long story man could you wait to fight kaido <laughs> yeah for real i want to see his pov right now how do they know where it is them being here in danger though he's right actually no them not being here is still in danger though, because jack was like Fuck it i'm gonna start killing people anyways it doesn't even matter he never found the freaking uh, ninja that may or may not even be here. Dude, poor Brooke. I genuinely feel bad for this man. Luffy saying, Peckums, you have nice eyes or beautiful eyes. Banquet! So oh, banquet! Let's go! Oh, goodness. Yeah, the ups and downs of this arc are so bizarre. It doesn't follow the standard One Piece arc formula. It's been all over the place just because things are so chaotic in terms of, like, the grander scheme of things. They're, we're actually having a banquet. This is insane. This is insane. I'm surprised Luffy can, like, so casually be like, yeah, bang, we're, let's have fun, instead of just, like, booking it for where Saji is. Wait, this is the second banquet of the arc. I just realized we had a banquet with, like, the dog and all of them when they saved them the first time. And I still don't get the scooping thing. I don't get it. Lasagna. So like lasagna is like a Garfield reference, right? Like Garfield started the like cat lasagna thing, no? If so, the fact that Oda is like a Garfield enjoyer is the funniest thing ever. All it's left is for freaking Cat Viper to be like, ah, Mondays. Oh, it's looking like it's getting a little bit light outside. It's time for the dog's turn. Again, I think this whole thing will bring the cat and the dog closer together, though. Forgetting something important, bro. Bro, Sanji, go after him. Figure that out. What is Luffy forgetting? And they all just passed out. I was like, okay, okay. I, I can't, bro. They're so irresponsible. It's insane. There is no way they haven't made it up yet. Is that Kinemon and Conjuro? Dog, dog. What are they doing all the way out here? Oh, was he saying I'm forgetting about like Kinemon? He has a whale hair! We mature adults must get our act together. <laughs> the three mature ones in the crew. Are they like, are they keeping watch? Oh, they're waiting for Kinemon to warn him. That's right, that's right. Yeah, they were waiting for Kinemon to kind of keep him hidden so they wouldn't freak out that a samurai was coming. But again, poor Momo just chilling in like a closet somewhere still. Thank goodness some of these straw hats are responsible. I mean, it's been like, what, 10 episodes? And he still hasn't made it up? Oh my gosh, man. This poor thing. They made it! Oh, all three of them are going to be asleep. Yep. Yep, there's Frank. Yep. Yep. About what I expected. 
It's just about what I expected. And they don't even see him. Okay, they're just gonna keep going. Who's that? Is the third with them that freaking like little tiny monkey? Dude. <laughs> It was a disaster, to say the least, bro. Do they see them? Oh no, it's gonna get a. Oh no. Oh no. What did you think it was? It is blue. Monkey fellow. I like his little hat. Oh, no, he freaks out. Okay, yeah. So is he technically part of the Ming tribe? That's why he's scared. They're gonna run in and they're gonna get jumped by the Minx, man. Oh no. How did all three of them fall asleep? They were supposed to be the responsible ones. He's crying. I mean, he probably thinks everything's about to get obliterated again. Did this monkey not see on the way up? Like, oh, these guys are pretty chill, actually. I don't know. I, you'd think by then that it was a pretty bonding experience. 767. <laughs> I like how Brooke sleeps just. <laughs> how would he know that they've arrived? Just because it is morning? Oh, the painting on the ground. Oh my gosh, she's blood. Ryunosuke! The grave of Ryunosuke! <laughs> I like how the bit of Robin, like, loving Ryunosuke is still a thing. Man, <laughs> the world would be in real trouble if Kanjiro knew how to draw. Oh my gosh, man. He was like a good artist. If he was a good artist and Frankie still had the freaking Pluton blueprints, blueprints, he'd just draw the Pluton. It'd be over. <gasps> Yeah, this game. No, the one right next to it. So stupid. God, that's such a cool island, man. Dude, this little monkey is gonna like sound the alarms, man. Oh my, like literally. He went right to his post. Oh no, not everybody's gonna freak out, man. Mass panic for no reason. Oh. Now, how long will it take Luffy and them to see its Kenamon and be able to like... Well, I mean, the thing is, they'll already know that samurai are here. It's like a bad situation all around. They won't want them here solely because they're samurai. Oh, the dog is up. I don't see Luffy anywhere, bro. This is going to be bad. Bro, Kenamon and Kanjiro might die. I'm not going to lie. They might just body them. Oh, wait, the cat's getting into action. To oh, no, wait, they're actually dead. The cat and the dog are acting? Oh, no. Nah. Sayonara, it's GG's. It was good knowing you, get him on. Got a damn army against you. Bro, the way BB runs. <laughs> Maybe this is what will bring the cat and the dog together. Mayhaps. Oh, no, man. Oh, no. They're the only ones sleeping. Oh my god, bro. Zoro is hung over as hell. Look at that, man. I recognize that look. They're just like casually like, ah, oh, whatever those bells are. It sounds so lovely. <laughs> Dude, something about Kinemon's face, the way he's just always like, hmm. <laughs> oh no. Clueless. Oh no. Oh lord, this is bad. Someone's gonna book it out of the bushes and just full on tackle him. It's just gonna be. Momo! Oh my gosh, the reunion! How did he get there so fast? Aww. He's so small. Bro, he's more excited to see Conjuro. I guess because he didn't know if he was okay or not in Dress Rosa. Look at that smile. Atta boy. Oh no, now Momo's gonna be in danger too. Oh, this is a disaster. So has Momo just been like sneaking around the woods? My gosh, that's so dangerous. Also, Momo's just as... Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> uh, Nami forgot his name. I forgot Kajiro's name several times though, to be fair. Oh my gosh, Luffy. Bro, I feel like, like everyone's just hung over from the banquet. This is not the best time. I guess a lot are still also very injured from Jackson's higher rampage. I'm sorry, guys. It wasn't personal. The question is who finds them first? 
God, he's a unit, man. Huh? Oh, the fact that the dog's there too. Oh, he doesn't know. What did he just assume the dog is there? Isn't it the dog size the daytime? The cat's at night. The, the fact that they're so close. Well, will they fight on sight? <gasps> the double take? <laughs> oh, dude. Is that gonna turn? Ben, Benjo's freaking out, bro. He's freaking out. Bro, what happened between them? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh dude, come on. It was him yelling. Uh. Now what? This is the way they just fight each other. Their nation has been through hell. They gotta put aside their differences, man. Uh. Pedro's going to be like a unifier. Guys, come on, there's no way. There's no way they straight up fight. Do they hate each other that much? That you care more about fighting each other than fighting these samurai in your land? Oh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh gosh, this is so un unknowing, man. It's so bad. What? Wait, what? Did he recognize one of them? <laughs> I love get him on his facial reactions. Are... Oh my gosh, there they are. They got to him. They actually made it in time. Oh my goodness. Dude, that little perv, man. He stared right. He stared right down. You saw that? He looked right down like laser pointers. You're becoming more monstrous. Be nice, Duke. Be nice. Yeah, bro, and you lost an arm. Like, <laughs> we counting limbs? I like how they don't, ha they, like, the groups don't hate each other. They just, like, they're more scared about their leaders fighting. And the more important question is, like, why is Raizo so important? Like, one single ninja? Or are, like, ninjas more rare? Either that or, like, he wronged Jack's crew, maybe. God, I'm such a freaking unit, man. There's no way they off-screen me. There's just no way. I refuse to believe it. No way do we get, like, a slow play of his hand getting cut off, too. <laughs> no way! No way, man! <laughs> <laughs> He's like struggling on it. So to immobilize his arms, they just cut one off. Wait, so was it not even Jack that took his arm? Oh, it wasn't. I thought it was like a poetic thing that Jack took an arm and a leg from the two leaders, but it was just happenstance. Oh, okay. Should have just speared it off. Oh, dude. Come on. That's so childish, man. We need to know more about, like, what happened, though. But who did Kinemon, like, recognize? And the electricity still bewilders me. Oh, Kinemon's just going out there. After they already told him to stop. Brother! He's lost the entire plot! They made it in time and it didn't even matter! Ay, ay, ay. Samurai? Okay, this will break him up, though, actually. Maybe it's a good thing. Well, it's all out there. Mask off, guys. Oh, wow, that actually did split them apart. Now they're just walking towards them. The nation over anything. Good. I I, I would think that they would prefer that. I'm a retainer of the Kozuki clan. The Kozuki clan. A retainer? Oh, no. Oh, no, don't say Raizo. No. There's so much trauma, bruh. Oh, it's over. Oh, it's so over. Oh, Luffy got serious. At least he locked in. Surely this doesn't end up with them fighting, right? That'd be silly. A waste of time and energy, guys. Luffy, say something, bro. You should be the middleman. Oh, this is so awkward. What? Huh? Why did they just say it? What's this? <laughs> what? Raizo must be here then. They did know. What? No, son. What? 
What a twist! A twisty twist! Oh, damn. They're crying because their job is done, but like all they went through. Bro, how damn important is Rizo? What? They were serious. No wonder Jack prodded so hard. He was here. Dude. So did Kinemon recognize one of them? Like either the dog or cat? Yeah, where is Rizo? They all knew and they all kept the secret safe. Even the people. They all knew. They all knew. Damn. What a nation, man. I hope it was worth it. Yeah, they didn't even tell them. That's true. Plan of Wano's Kozuka clan and we have been like a family? What? Uh, oh my gosh but the dog and cat still hate each other even though all this turmoil is thrown at them why <laughs> well i'm not gonna lie that simplifies a lot of things because now we don't have to explain everything because apparently they already knew but dude what a a, a very touching scene of them sitting down and what a cool twist because yeah we have been under the impression the entire time that nobody knew and they sold it really well over the course of like 15 20 episodes so now to have that new impression and then to see all the random civilian smiles and then thinking back to them being like stabbed and prodded and killed even some of them died during jack's attack and still not giving up rizo bro how important is Rizo? Has to be stupid important. But at the same time, he's probably not powerful then. Because if Rizo was as powerful as they're like protecting him to be, he would have been able to stand up against Jack. But now Jack's crew, and I guess uh, Kaido inherently too, is under the impression that Rizo isn't here, but we still don't even know why they were after him. Ah, oh, dude. Oh my gosh, man. There's too many moving parts. I love it though. But still, we. Uh, I would say that everything is perfect here on Zo now. We still have this conflict between the dog and the cat to figure out. And I think we're going to get some backstory there. I feel like we have to get backstory there to really, truly understand it. Because like I said, you would just assume in any other circumstance that they would be brought together over the course of this trauma of the nation, but they're still not. So it has to be really deeply rooted for them to not get over it like this. But guys, that's been it for my reaction to Zoe today. I hope you did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like on this one. It helps me out quite a bit. And I'll catch you next time. Peace, peace.